Welcome back to my channel. Sorry about the last upload. I know it was like a good solid documentary, but this one, guys, is getting some real shit, okay? We're at the beautiful place, our home. This is more our home than our actual house, you know, that's <laughs> fucked. We're that passionate about Starbucks, we decided to take it to a different level. For every coffee that these guys make that's actually good, I'm gonna tip them £100 each and we're going to multiple souls. Man's gonna be spending racks today on broke as fuck, but you know what? It's for the Starbs. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Where am I going with this? Inside. They make some coffee is like a bag of shit. Like I had one about three weeks ago. Tasted like water with like some ketamine in there. If they make it shit, they don't get a tip. If they make it good, they get a massive tip. And I'm going to be personally asking for the waiter. Barista. Okay, I'm going to be personally asking for the barista <laughs> or barista, however you say that. So I can like personally tip them. Can I get a caramel latte, please? Can you have a grande? Um, yes, please. Do you have a caramel macchiato? Yes, please. please. <laughs> Can I have a sausage sandwich as well, please? Yo, 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 here we go. Yo, you ready, Chloe? I'm scared. What are you doing down there? Boys and girls, you see this money right here? Yeah, this is for the Starbucks staff. A good coffee can go a long way, man. This Starbucks particularly has got me through so much shit. Chloe cheated on me last week. And I just Fuck had off! No, I just had one of these and like, she didn't cheat on me anymore. It like fixed everything. It's got depression, just have a Starbucks sorted. This ain't even a brand deal, man. I forgot how to make videos on my personal channel. <laughs> so I just scream and stuff like ah! Obviously pay for this and then if it's amazing, then I got a little surprise for whoever made what it, is, man. What is it? And I'll I'll tell you in a second, man. Oh my god. How you feeling? Brilliant, man. I just can't wait to chip your heart, yo. Yeah, what is it? No, no, it's good. This better be a fucking good coffee. Put my trust and my faith into these guys, you know. That's yours. If the Starbucks is good, I'm tipping £100 to every coffee I get. It's amazing, yo. We got cash, man. We're ready. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Split that between you guys, man. Honestly, this is the best Starbucks ever, so. Probably be back in about half an hour because that one's gonna be shit. So bye. This coffee, it was worth my hundred pound tip, hundred percent. Yeah, feeling a bit drowsy today. I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna get me through it, man. Yo, how's your sausage sandwich, man? It's fucking piff G. It tastes like wench. I'm going into a sausage coma. Have you ever had a sausage coma pizza? So you have like chopped up diced bell ends, yeah, and Cumberland sausages mixed with green herbs and ravioli. You have that put on a on the side of a pizza, and then you have a basket of orange juice tipped all over you. So sick, dude. <laughs> Calling you dude is the funniest thing I've ever done in my life. Next Starbucks, if I give somebody a tip and they don't appreciate it, that's one of my pet hates, man. If I go to a Starbucks and tip them, yeah, for making a good coffee and they're like, Oh, thanks. I'll get out and punch them. If I tip you £100, yeah, don't say thank you. Get down on your knees and start crying. I can't say that. What do you mean? They need to have a mental breakdown if I give them £100. I need to see them at their lowest point. I need to see them sitting on the floor like, Nah! Sorry if you got. Oh! Ah! Yeah. Okay, how do I turn the camera on? Is it on? We're driving, summer's kicking in, the weather's getting better, guys. What more That's could man. you want, yeah, than a hundred pound Starbucks man. tip and a sausage coma pizza? Woo! Cheese! Do you know what I really fancy after that coffee? What? Coffee. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> coffee. I'm waiting until there's no queue because I'm scared. <laughs> I feel like they're prepared. not prepared for the tips right now. Not prepared for my tip. What? What's the drink they can fuck up easy? If you think I'm tipping someone 100 quid for making a hot chocolate, <laughs> you got another thing coming. Oh, I'm gonna go get one. Caramel macchiato, please. And then can I get like a shot of like um, hazelnut in there as well as the coffee, please? I didn't get you a drink, but maybe I was thinking we could share it. I just got myself like a caramel macchiato of hazelnut. Ice? No, hot. It's okay. You're so mean. <laughs> no, no, no. Let me do it. Let me do it. Oh, all right yourself and every member of Starbucks in the world and I'll just sort myself. This looks unreal. Try that. Look how small it is. What did you get? Um <laughs> you even know what you got. Now I know what you got man you got a urine sample with coffee in it yeah. Taste this because this is the best ice drink. No I'm passionate about this and I will give them my last hundred pound in my bank account. I won't, but I'll tell them that I would have. <laughs> I'm gonna go tip him in a second. Shit, son. We're making a YouTube video, right? We're tipping Starbucks workers, like money, if they make a good coffee. And that was one of the best ones I've tried. So I'm gonna tip you hundred pound, man. 20, 40, 
60, 80, 100, there you go, man. No worries, man. Thank you for the good coffee as well. Spend it wisely, man. <laughs> Okay, next one, ladies and gentlemen. Can I just have like uh, a glass of milk? Like a little medium grande cup of milk, please? Yeah, just cold milk. Yes, please. Thank you. If they make this perfect, straight up 100 pounds, man. <laughs> this is gonna be a sick one. Yo, that's mad, yeah. 2 pound five for some milk. Let's see. It's perfect, man. 20, 40, 60, 80. There you go. That's for you guys, man, for making. Yeah, take it. That's some good milk, I swear, Dan. That milk was bomb. Yo, that's <laughs> mad. Should we go back around? How good do you reckon their tap water is? Oh my god, that's like an important ingredient. Exactly. A medium water, please, in a grande cup. Using water in a grande cup? Yeah, do you want ice? Um, yes, please. This ain't gonna be tip worthy. The milk, I can tell they spent some time on that. The water, I know this ain't gonna be it, chief. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. I'll try it now, and then if it's good enough, I'll tip you again, man. It's great. Fucking hell, you killed it with that. Safe, bro. Oh my god, thank you so much. I love you. <laughs> they are so lucky! <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Next Starbucks, man. Bit of a change up, right? We're going to Costa. <laughs> fuck off, are so we? Fuck Costa. Every single time we've gone there, order's been wrong, or the coffee just tastes like fucking Internet Melts episode three by Joe Weller. I'm gonna be reading all these comments and I'm gonna reply to a bunch of them as well. What do you prefer, Starbucks or Costa? I need to know. Let me know down in the comment section. My personal preference is Starbucks. Starbucks. I never even liked, Starbucks. I never even liked coffee before Starbucks, man. Starbucks. Starbucks, is my football chant. Oh, we would rather have a Starbucks than Chloe. I would rather have a Starbucks than Chloe. I would rather have a Starbucks. Rather have a Starbucks. Rather have a Starbucks than Chloe. You know when Joe Weller jumps into Jake Paul's diss track? I just did a Joe Weller and jumped into my own diss track. Yo, you fucked it, man. I would rather have a microwave on my head. I would rather have a microwave on my head. I would rather have a microwave. <laughs> Are you okay? I would rather have a dark fruits than a wife music video. That will be coming soon. We need to do that, man. We're off to fucking Starbucks for another bevy. Another bell. I might do another one of these, but the next time I'll go to different cafes and I'll donate money to people who can make the best full English breakfasts. <gasps> that we should travel to every single shop that sells mini eggs and eat every single bag of mini eggs and then I will tip every single bag of mini eggs. <laughs> Do you know I'll tip you in a bit if you don't shut up. I'll put my tip in your mouth so you can't speak. <laughs> I didn't say nothing about like <gasps> sex. I said tip in your mouth. You're gonna put my money in your mouth. That's stealing. The only people That's stealing. <laughs> That's the only reason I'm with you for your tip. <laughs> anyway, Starbucks. Next drive through. Here we go. Can I have a peep? Citrus green tea, please. And that's it, thank you. We should create a new YouTube channel called The Talent Sisters. 100 quid, lads. You know, you look like a silver surfer. According to sources, you can manipulate cosmic energy. From I space. actually do that sometimes. Like oh, spare time. you do actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's in bed and that, and then like use cosmic energy to do things that nobody should hear about. Thank you. I'm so intrigued. Oh my god. Bye. The moment of truth is here. We're gonna let you know if this tastes banging. Yes, yes. lads, you're right. <laughs> I predict an earthquake up um, in here. <laughs> labyrinth, come in. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot you rude little mouth, yeah. Now how does that taste honestly? Come on, give me a give me a little bit of a I'm shut your rude little mouth. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Does that taste like Denzel Corey's armpits? Do you can ever go for a jog, come back and try it, it'll be alright. I think you should ask your viewers what they prefer. This Starbucks is a bag of wank. I ain't tipping them, yeah. Oh, whatever. But I fully recommend, yeah, getting the pitcher of citrus green tea, whatever the fuck Peach. it is. Peach! Literally just stole my drink off me. He just said to me, I didn't know. So, hang on. I'm not sure about me. In this world, right, when you've uploaded four videos in the space of a year, yeah, you aren't worthy of a Starbucks, so shut your mouth, yeah. Second of all, yeah, the people are waiting for your uploads, yeah, and you're there like... Shy. What did I just do? <laughs> I get shy. 
Oh, don't do that! <laughs> Should I tip them for that? Go and bang a rack on the desk. All right then, Go and bang a rack. Would you record the insults video of me tomorrow night? You want to actually make a video? Subscribe to Chloe's channel. Yeah, there's an insults match ASMR me versus her tomorrow on a channel. Subscribe, yeah, and you get to see firsthand. Oh my God, this is gonna be sick. Perfect. She's mean to me anyway, guys. You should have said it the other day, right? Like, this massive slab of marble, the weight of a Range Rover Sport, yeah. She picks it up, yeah, and bangs me around the back of the head with it, and I had concussion for about a week. It literally only knocked you out for 10 minutes, so I don't know what you're moaning about. Yo, tell me why the back of my head looked like leather. We're only tipping £50 at this one, because I'm not really keen on this coffee. Really like the Pitrus. It's peach citrus. No, it's not. It's Pitrus seeing green tea. Remember what I said? If he doesn't get on his knees and start crying, I want my money. Back. You're doing this for kindness. No, I'm doing this for the reaction. When we first met, I used to think you had Spanish in you, you know. I did have Spanish in me for a while. Like... You had a few showers and your Spanish ran down the drain. Starbucks, I want you here to do a cow pole latte. That would be amazing! But I'm gonna tip you like 50 pounds, man. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Best thing I've ever drank in my life, man. Do you too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries, man. Bye. Oh my heart. Can we go back and give him another 50? Yo, don't get a girlfriend, man. They cost you money. All right, then. Give him my passport and the deeds to my house. You guys are really pretty, so there's another 50 pound, man. Okay. Yeah, no worries. Enjoy it, man. <laughs> well, that wasn't as nice, though. He was... <laughs> They're so confused. They're so confused. An egg mayo sandwich. Vanilla latte, please. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120. 140, 150 pounds to this Starbucks. You know why? Sean is the man, yeah. And this Starbucks in Battlefield Shrewsbury is the littest Starbucks ever, yeah. I know he's gonna be a very happy man after this. He's here nearly every cry. single time we come. Do you want me to tell him now I'm here? <laughs> So we got a tip for you, man, because we know you're such a hard-working guy and we see you like every time we come here. 150 there. Me? Yeah, take it, man. Because you're such a nice guy, man, and like... Thanks, mate. It's, Thank like, so it's okay. We I'll love admit. you. This will be, like, so helpful. In a bit, dude. He oh, was about to cry. Oh God, He's, He's about to cry. cry. Guys, do you want 20 pounds? There you go, man. It's for choosing Starbucks over Costa, man. Oh. So, fuck Costa. <laughs> Sean said he used to be a teacher, right? To pay at Starbucks is shit. I'm gonna go give him the rest of the money. You're right. You're right. <laughs> yeah, man. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 40. 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300 pound, man. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Thank you so much. Keep working hard, man. I love you too, so much. We nah. love you. <laughs> Thank you so much. See you in a bit, man. Bye. In a bit, dude. <laughs> all the people in Starbucks are just like, what the fuck is going on? Did you see all their faces? I mean, this says literally no better feeling in this world than helping someone, and that's really selfish. It's a bit of like of a personal thing, yeah, to me and Chloe, because like every morning we wake up, our house is like a construction site at the moment, yeah. We're living out of like a fucking bedroom with clothes all over the floor at the moment, and it's fucking shit, man. Wake ourselves up by coming here, have a Starbucks every morning, and have like some breakfast there and it's kind of like a good start to the day and Sean is always so happy here yeah, and he's like always so enthusiastic about his job and it's crazy like how good someone can make you feel about your day just from like being nice to people just smiling man so you know what one day yeah I'm gonna walk in there yeah I'm gonna drop him 10 grand you know he used to be a teacher and now he works at Starbucks and I think by well, the sound of how he just said that he probably like struggles sometimes on money and shit, so. If you enjoyed this video, smash the like button. You guys watching and liking this video kind of supports giving and helping other people like the video. Comment down below what else you wanna see. I'll see you in the next one, man. He has no idea what's going on right now. I've literally set up the camera. He's just got in from, where did you go, Tesco? Got some bits and bobs, got a little kebab as well. Birthday meal, you know what I'm saying? This guy has no idea what's going on. This is gonna be a beautiful birthday present, bro. I don't like when you say things like this because because anything that you say